That was a pretty tough one. I mean, all the boss fights feel pretty tough, honestly. They feel good tough, though. Like, not too... Not, too. not like hitting you over the head with the mechanics, but also not, like, too... What's the word I'm thinking of? Cerebral? It's not making you sit there figure, figuring out a puzzle. Stuff still in here. I do apparently usually miss at least like one thing in these boss rooms, like while I'm doing the initial run for which was a little bit clearer of some of the items or some of the items were. Like in the heat of the battle, like the intention is for you to pick them up and use them, like ammo or heals or whatever. It should be like relatively out in the open, or at least in places that you would walk by and like see it pretty prominently. I don't know. I don't know where it is. Treasure, of course it is. Miranda is abominable. Her deceit knows no bounds. We are merely a bunch of failed Cadu experiments to her. I was just lucky I had more affinity to the stuff than the other poor schmucks in the village. So she still calls me her son. What a joke. I'll never forgive her for what she did to me. That crazy bitch has never been right in the head. She can't see a difference between experiment and family. Miranda didn't just change my body. She took my dignity. If I don't kill her, then my life will never be my own. Still, she may be crazy, but she's also powerful. She can turn into anyone using the mega my seat. The trick is that brat Rose. If I could access her power, then maybe... Speaking of the kid's dad, Ethan has a pretty interesting body himself. Maybe I could get him to help me out. Interesting body? Fuck, is Ethan... some... modified in some way too? I mean, I guess that would make sense. He literally reattached his arm with a fucking medical spray. Like, I know this is Resident Evil, but... And that... You know what, speaking of, that happens in 7, too. It's even a different hand. Or a different arm. Yeah, a different hand. She may be crazy, but she's also powerful. She can turn into anyone using the Mega My Seat. What does that mean, she can turn into anyone? I swear, is she fucking Albert Wesker? <laughs> Yeah. 
music. I see. Guys are coming alive. And I assume these walls have been broken down. He's a little brutal to throw another fight at you right after you uh, finish what seems to be a boss fight. I've got a rebellion. So stay out of my way. Don't come back. <laughs> Again? <sighs> yeah, you're telling me. You were telling me, dude. <gasps> I told you to leave it alone, Ethan. You are in the way. What do you care, Chris? You killed my wife, you son of a bitch! You think I killed Mia? That wasn't her. It was Miranda. What? She's a bioweapon. She changed her appearance and pretended to be Mia. Seems she also survived being shot, so now I'm here to finish the job. Bullshit! Why don't you fucking tell me right away? Because I knew you would want to be involved. And this job is hard enough without civilians getting in the way. Why us, Chris? What the hell is going on? All right, Ethan. All right. I guess I owe you an explanation. Uh, yeah. A little bit. Hand me that wrench. Is he gonna hit me over the head? Give it to 
I don't get to hear the explanation? Long story short, Miranda's fucking insane. In this village, all these monsters and freaks, this is her life's work. Some sort of crazy experiment with the mold. The mold. Like Louisiana. God damn it. All this time, I thought I could save my family. I can't escape from here. I can't do anything! Might not be true. Take a look at this. My men sent those pictures a few minutes ago. Miranda. Keep looking. Rose. Holy shit, we gotta go! Relax, my men are monitoring the situation. But they have my daughter. You don't get anything. You don't stand a chance against Miranda by yourself. <laughs> I will stay down here and finish planting explosives. You take that elevator, I'll meet you topside. I promise you, we will get your daughter back. Together. Damn straight we will. And when I find Miranda, she's a dead man. <laughs> he carved the gun that he just got pulled out of his hand. All right, Ethan. <laughs> Even Chris You take this cute. and do me a favor. Try to stay under the radar. With the, with the fucking... Chainsaw tank? You can't turn back now. Oh, fuck. So Chris is just fucking hiding out down here, making a little fucking tank. Squad. The sweep of the factory is complete. No proof of any connection with the organization. Guess this just wasn't our lucky day. I did manage to get my hands on a number of documents disclosing some of Miranda's experiments, which support our previous theories. She seems to have infected herself with the mutamyce, which has granted her a number of abilities, including mimicry. She can control her cells and transform herself to look like anyone or anything. She disguised herself as Mia and infiltrated the Winter's home. Her objective was clearly to kidnap Rose. Maybe she thought she could control Rose easier if she looked like her mom. When we attacked, it put a little damper on her plans, so she mimicked a corpse. She then revived herself in the transport truck, kill killed everyone on board, and took off with Rose. Things didn't go the way she had originally planned, but in the end, she still got what she wanted. Until now. It's time to rendezvous and blow this place sky high. This might turn into a fight with Heisenberg, but I think I found something useful. He left one of his little toys laying around, and it's even made from a metal polymer composite, which he can't control. Time to turn the tables. Cool. Why would the dude keep something like that? Something that he can't control. Alright. <laughs> I like how it's a long... It's a long hold there. You have to hold that for like a good like five seconds. Metal polymer composite, huh? Time to fight fire with fire. I mean, Heisenberg wants to. I'm kill coming, her. Rose. I don't get why they wouldn't. Someone. I know he's probably a trustworthy. I'm sure he would look. Before I kill that bitch. Let's say this. Man, 
and men. Your courts will be another addition to my army. Hey now, you dead already? I'll die on the world's watch. Too slow. That one hurt. I promise. <laughs> Oh, 
those in the afterlife. Lose his power as one. Right after I murder Moran. <laughs> This can't be the end for me! I must kill her! Shit, man. Crystal. I dealt with Heisenberg. Now I'm gonna find Miranda and get Rose back. Not without me. It's too dangerous. Wait there, you hear me? Ethan? Rose? Ethan! Ethan, respond! Yeah? What? Our child. She's so important, isn't she? She's everything to me. <laughs> and mine to me. With Heisenberg on, you've lost your lead. What are you going to do? I don't know, but I'm saving Rose. You'd never know, do you? Even when I took Mia's place in your home. Poor Ethan. Who are you? Where's Rose? <laughs> <laughs> Remember Evelyn and her power over them all? Rose is her successor. No. Rose is Evelyn's true, complete form. She will grow to fully control the masses. And I must have her. Fuck you, you crazy bitch! Calm yourself. Rose will be safe. The Mega My Seat catalogs all of us. However, she will be reborn as my daughter. She's my child, not yours! Where are you? Show yourself! Why did Rose come to be? Yeah. Was it because of her? Yeah, it was her. And you are truly a special case. But I've learned all I can from you. Your worth as a lab rat has run out. Miranda! You coward! Come out and face me! Don't worry. Your death will come quick. You will join the Mega My Seeds records. Oh shit, that's his fucking heart. Man. I will make sure to sample your blood for later. Once dawn breaks, the ceremony will be complete, and I will become her true mother, bound for eternity in blood. <laughs> oh, yeah. She's straight tore his heart out. I've I... waited so long. But dreams really can come true. Vessel or not. I can't wait to see my true child 